Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm gonna show you what to do in case your Microsoft Store is stuck at pending and your apps are not installing at all. You wait a few minutes and they are still at pending. In this video, I'm gonna show you a few steps, a few easy steps that you can do or try in order to fix this issue. First of all, to get everything out of the way, we're gonna use the Windows Travel Shooter. So just go to the Settings app, just type in Search Settings or go to Start and Settings, then go down a bit to Update and Security and then click on Troubleshoot. Click on Additional Troubleshooters and then scroll down to the bottom where it says Windows Store Apps. Click on it and then click on Run the Troubleshooter. Basically, Windows will try to diagnose your computer, will try to fix any issues that come up with your Microsoft Store, and after the troubleshooting process is finished, you should try to install your apps and see if the problem is fixed. Of course, follow all the steps that are required, and Microsoft will try to fix your problem or give suggestions that can help you fix the issue. Of course, in this case, this is not relevant for our issue, Microsoft account required. We assume that you are already locked logged into a Microsoft account and your apps are not installing, they are stuck at pending. Next up, we're going to press the Windows plus R keys at the same time on our keyboard and we're going to type in here wsreset.exe and then press enter. Basically, this will reset the store app. So wait for the process to be finished. As you can see here, a new command prompt window was opened up. Wait for the process to be finished until the store app will load up. Exit out from the store app, then right click on the start menu and then click on Windows PowerShell as admin and then click on yes. And in PowerShell, you're going to have to paste in this command and then press enter. Wait for a few seconds and the Microsoft Store app should be re-registered. After you've tried all these steps, don't forget to restart your system. And then after the restart, check and see if you can install your Windows or your Store apps with no issues. So I'm hoping that after watching this video, your problem will be fixed. If the video was useful, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBased. Until next time, have a nice day.